prophesy that in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I am crossing over. We are crossing over. You are crossing over to take over in the year 2024 in the name of Jesus Christ. I am crossing over. We are crossing over. You are crossing over to take over what God has in store for you, the blessings, the goodness, the message of God that he has for you in the year 2024. You shall not die, but you shall live and declare the wonderful works of the Lord. So I want you to declare, I am crossing over. My family and I are crossing over. We are crossing over by faith in Jesus' name to take over in Jesus' name. So shall it be in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen and amen and amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Father. Christ, we are alive. Psalms 124 says, If it had not been for the Lord who was on our side, let Israel say, and that's our testimony, that if it hadn't been for God, if it hadn't been for Jesus, if it hadn't been for the Holy Spirit working in us, protecting us, defending us, shielding us from evil, frustrating the plans and the plot of evil, bringing us out of countless dangers, countless issues and problems and challenges and afflictions, if it hadn't been for the Lord on your side, on my side, Whilst evil men, wicked men plotted evil against us, where would you be? From January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. You have come this far by the grace and the mercies of God. It is God who has kept you and I. We thank him. We have come this far by grace and mercy. If it had not been for the Lord on your side, on my side, on our side, where would we be? So we want to say thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. And we are praying and asking the Lord to baptize us with his Holy Ghost and with his power in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ to finish well. May God help you and I to finish well. To finish what? Well. To finish strong, not weak. Not finishing fatigued, not worried, not fainting, not hopeless, not despaired, not giving up, not quitting. May the Lord give us the grace, the anointing to finish well, meaning that you finish on a good note and also to finish victorious, meaning that whatever issue, whatever battle, whatever trials, whatever tribulation, whatever challenges, whatever issues you are dealing with, you are going to have victory over that issue. So may the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob anoint you and give you the grace, the anointing to finish well, to finish strong, and to finish victorious in the name of Jesus Christ. Begin to pray that the Lord Almighty will give you fresh anointing to finish well. Fresh anointing. Fresh anointing. Receive the grace. Receive the grace to finish well. Receive the grace to finish strong. Receive the grace to finish victorious. Receive supernatural fresh oil. Fresh anointing. Fresh power. Power from on high in the name of Jesus. Let the weak be stronger. Let the weak be stronger. Let the sick be healed up by the empowerment of the Holy Ghost. Up. Be emboldened, be revived, up. be rejuvenated by the Holy Ghost power. Be reinvigorated by the Holy Ghost power. Receive supernatural vitality and power and oil and grace, extra oil, fresh anointing, fresh grace. For those who wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up on wings like eagles. They shall run and not be worried. They shall walk and not faint. You shall finish and finish well. You shall finish and finish strong. You shall finish victoriously. You will overcome all the odds. You shall overcome all the battles. You shall overcome every challenges in the name of Jesus Christ. Not by might, not by power, by the spirit of the living God. You are finishing well in the name of Jesus Christ. Receive power, receive strength, receive vitality in Jesus name. This is very important. The precious blood of Jesus Christ becoming a seal of protection on your life so that no evil, no weapon formed or fashioned against you will ever prosper so that you can finish and cross over into the new year without any blemish, without any calamity, without any casualty, without any 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 attack from the pit of hell against you because you are protected your sons and daughters are protected your husbands and wives are protected your family members are protected your properties are protected by the precious blood of jesus christ by the angels of the lord by the spirit of god you are under the divine protection of god in jesus name the bible says now the blood shall be a sign for you on the houses where you are and when i see the blood I will 
pass over you and the plague shall not be on you to destroy you when i strike the land of egypt and the plague meaning the destroyer will not be able to touch to harm you because you carry the seal of divine protection which is the blood of jesus christ make precious blood let the precious blood of jesus christ be a passover for you for your sons for your daughters for your husbands for your wives for your brothers and sisters your family members may they all come under the divine protection of the blood of jesus christ and may the blood deliver you from sicknesses deliver you from witchcraft attacks deliver you from accident deliver you from injury deliver you from hurt and harm deliver you from the arrows that flies by day the terror by night deliver you from the striking you by day and the, the, the moon by night striking you and attacking you may the blood of jesus christ deliver you from sicknesses and diseases and from the wickedness of the wicked may you come under divine protection because of the blood may the blood protect you from accident whatever the enemy has orchestrated composed manufactured against you may you escape it all because of the blood of jesus christ we are going to pray that let the blood of jesus christ save us our passover begin to plead the blood as your passover the blood the blood the blood the blood lord preserve and protect us we plead the blood we plead the blood we plead the blood over our sons and daughters we plead the blood of our husbands and wives we plead the blood of our brothers and sisters we plead the blood of our moms and dads we plead the blood of our family members we plead the blood of our going out and coming in we plead the blood of our houses we plead the blood of our marriages we plead the blood of our families we plead the blood over our cars we plead the blood over our jobs our finances we plead the blood over everything that that is dear to us and everything that we own our properties are covered by the blood our finances are covered our jobs are covered by the blood our neighborhood our communities are covered by the blood lord preserve us protect us let no evil let no accident let no injury let no premature death let no calamity no no spells no charms no excess no definition no enchantment be able to have any effect on us because we are covered we are enveloped we are we, we are we are surrounded in the name of Jesus in the blood in the name of Jesus we are soaked in the blood we are soaked in the blood but we are engulfed in the blood we are engulfed in the blood we are surrounded by the precious blood of Jesus as our Passover we plead the protection we plead the protection Lord as we are about to uh, exit this year and make our entrance into the new year father preserve us Lord protect our children Lord protect us Lord protect our husbands and wives Lord protect us Lord protect our family members Lord protect us. Lord protect our going out and coming. Protect our cars. Protect our transportation system our commuting as we go out and come in lord preserve us as we step out from the house as we come back in preserve us O lord almighty from every atrocities from every disaster every misfortune every calamity any bad woman any spells and charms and witchcraft and demonic attacks lord deliver us by the precious blood deliver us show us your mercy and deliver us from generational curses from evil covenant from satanic O lord almighty demands on our lives evil spirits plotting evil against us lord let the blood of jesus christ save us our passover protect us lord and one on in one piece father god give us safety give us safety be our refuge be our shield be our defense be our high tower be our fortress and take us safely into the new season the new year in the name of jesus rapasa rakatoske remashata mansuko pronomo shanda ikasata yadaba in jesus name we pray um, announcement um god willing on the first god willing on the first minister esther is releasing a single album song saying thank you say thank you and uh, we just want you to join us to say thank you to god for seeing us through this year and also transitioning us safe and sound into the new year so 31st join us as we um um, she releases a new single called Say Thank You and it will be on her, it will be released on her YouTube platform, which is Minister Esther Word. Minister Esther Word. It will be released, God willing, January 1st. January 1st, that is the 1st of January. Um, and it, it's just saying thank you. It, the song is Say Thank You. Just say thank you. When you look back and you reflect on the goodness and the mercies of God, and how he has kept us from January until now. And by his grace, we've been able to cross over to see another year. Um, just join us in saying thank you 
and and thanking God for the new year uh, and, and for the new season and what he has in store for us. So help join us as we celebrate God with this new song called Say Thank You. It will be released on January 1st. Uh, so please subscribe to her YouTube channel, which is Minister Esther Word, Minister Esther Word YouTube channel. And that's where the song will be released. And uh, may you all support us just as you supported her in her previous um, singles. And may the Lord be a blessing to each and every one of us as we say thank you to God for his goodness and his mercies endure forever. Amen. So um, um, join us on January 1st on at Minister Esther Word YouTube channel to listen and to be blessed by the song say thank you father we thank you lord it's isaiah chapter 7 verse 14 isaiah chapter 7 verse 14 remember on the 31st after the fast 6 p.m we will burn the list we will burn the list into ashes every spirit behind the problem because many of the problems we are facing there are spread behind that's why your prayer will break and dismantle and destroy the strong forces that are making you go through that problem. That's why when we prophetically burn it, we are saying that we have destroyed the, inf the, the power, the potency behind the issue. You cross and you, you enter into the new year and you realize that something has changed. There's been a shift and you are moving into the glory of God for your life in the new season. Amen. No carry forward. No carry. We are not carrying any baggages and any um, challenges and any affliction or oppression, any witchcraft and any curses into the new year in Jesus' name. We are starting a new slate, expecting the new things God is wanting to do in our lives. And it shall be well with us in Jesus' name. Amen. Isaiah chapter.